Hey y'all, how's everybody doing tonight? Man, it's Friday night. It's a nice night on the water. I'm out here on my boat dock here at my house and I'm trying to get a little catfishing in. We've been having some 30, 40 mile an hour winds all day and about seven o'clock this evening the wind let down and, and it's just been a good afternoon and thought I'd come and toss in some lines. Wanted to put another video out tonight on some more tips and tricks about catfishing. What I want to talk to you about tonight in this video is how to throw a cast net. Now, what I have here is a four foot cast net. And I know most of you people, guys especially, have probably gotten a cast net for the birthday or for Christmas or something like that, or you got one sitting in the closet. Well, you need to put it to use, man. And uh, I thought I'd get you a video on how to throw this net. First thing we're gonna do we're gonna take the rope. It's got a loop on one end. I don't know if you can see that, it's kind of dark. But you loop the rope back through it, wrap it around your wrist. I like to wrap it around my wrist a couple of times because if you're not careful, you'll throw your net and the rope will come off your wrist and go in the water and it'll sink. You'll have to fish it out. Then after you do that, and you loop it around your wrist a couple of times, you wanna pull it tight, you wanna roll up the excess rope like this here roll it on up all the way up here <clears throat> some cast nets have a horn up here this one's got a loop I got this one at the beach a couple of years ago it's been a really good cast net but most cast nets have a horn this little loop deal whatever it doesn't matter so if you're right handed take the rolled up rope in your right hand, leave about that much slack until the horn or the loop. Take your net, place it with your right hand with the rope looped around it like this. Grab your net like that. Grab your net like this. Leave about that much hanging over on the top. Raise it up. On the bottom, there's loops. See those loops down there? Anyway, you take the loop, you bring it up, you grab it with your fingers on your right hand, and then you come over like this. Now you're ready to throw your cast net. Now what you're going to do, you're going to kind of, kind of like hitting a baseball. You're going to put your hips into it. And then you're going to kind of throw it out like, imagine a big kind of frisbee type deal. So anyway, I'm going to take this net, I'm going to throw it off the corner on my dock right here, and we're going to see what we can catch. I'll show you how to throw it. Y'all pay attention. It goes like this. And you want to make that net open up when you throw it. And if it opens up, when it's going down, if you've got any bait in it, you can kind of feel them kind of pulling on it a little bit. Then you're going to let it go to the bottom and pull it up pretty quick because if you don't pull it up quick, it'll get hung up. We pulled it out of the water. I don't know if you can see or not, but I've got a couple of shad in there. Now to get them out, you're going to let this top part down. The net's going to fall to the floor. Just kind of shake it. Then you can reach down and you can pick up your shad, kind of slick. But as you can see here, oh, there went that one. We got some shad, there went that one. And then you put them in your bucket and that's how you throw a cast net. So one more time, we've got the rope rolled up in our right hand. We've got a little slack from the top of the net. We're going to take the top of the net, grab it with our right hand, right in here, like this. Kind of pinch it, raise it up, grab those loops, make sure it's all untangled. Come out like this, over to up here like that, grab it with our fingers and our right hand, grab it, open it up with our left hand, and throw it and make it open up like this. Gonna let her net go to the bottom. 
You can kind of feel it pull down if there's something in it. Right when it touches the bottom, you raise it up or it'll get hung up. Then you pull it in. I usually wind the cord around my right hand when I'm pulling it in like this. You bring it up. I didn't get any shad that time, but I got a sand bass. Bounce it on the top. Got this little sand bass in here. Can't use him as bait because he's a game fish, so we're going to throw him back. But guys, that's how you throw a throw net. I appreciate you watching my video. Please subscribe to my channel. Feel free to share my video. I appreciate you guys. Y'all have a good night. Hopefully y'all can catch some fish.